Hey guys, I am at Draw. Uh, couldn't say it right. I'm at Ross Dress for Less here in Carbondale, Illinois. And Kathy, my subscriber, said I needed a minimalist bra. So I am shopping for one. I don't really see anything that is so called minimalist. I just see general stuff. And this is what guys they have. The shelves are kind of halfway stocked. They're better than they used to be um, over the past few years because of the pandemic. But this is what they got in this section. I found these in 3X. Um, that's close to my size, probably. So I think that's about all that I'm gonna find. There's some more Kathy Ireland, the same one on the bottom. And I'm going to walk over here. Let's see, it just says extra large. These just say extra large. They don't say minimalist. Um, what's the price on that? $16.99 for three of them. That is a really good deal, but I think, let me see that. Put it back for a moment so I can carry what's in. I picked out a shirt too, guys, a pretty shirt. That's the back of it. But I found it in a 1X and a 2X and I'm not sure what size is going to fit. There's a fitting room here, but these are padded. These are padded, so not sure which one. So I grabbed all this, and sorry you can't see me in the clip, but my, ro my camera won't rotate very easily. And um, that's the house floor section back there and where the fitting rooms used to be. I believe they moved them to the front of the store. And this is how like empty, there's not that many people in here. That's a view of our store. That's a view the other way. I'm gonna end this clip guys because there are a lot of people around and some people may not wanna be on camera but these are the panties these are the panties I'm not shopping for that though i got plenty of them okay guys see you in the next clip okay guys i'm in the fitting room and i got a big problem they've got a security tag on the back of the bra so i cannot remove the bras to try them on even the other ones I wanted to try on, just one of them that's in a different brand, different size and everything. Can't try on. The only thing I can try on is this shirt. This shirt. The shirts that are just one size different. This is the 1X and the one I'm about to put on is a 2X. So I'm going to try it on and then I will be back to show you guys. Okay guys, this is the shirt I found in a 2X. Looks pretty nice, but um, I don't know, what, what do you guys think? Should I buy it? It is, I forgot the price on it. Looking at it over here, $13.99. But I still gotta get the bras too. And if I spend too much, then I'll have to come back and return it because my husband will throw a fit. But this is, I'll show you in the mirror what I look like. Excuse my face, I didn't put makeup on. I just wanted to get up here. Okay, see you in the next clip. Okay guys, this is in the mirror. This is the front. And I'll try to show you the back. That's the back. This way with the camera fits pretty good and I'm glad I picked the 2x because I think the 1x 
looked too small on the shelf and I was right. See, this was a little tight getting it on. I think I've gained weight, but I'm not 100% sure. I was just at the doctor and the scale said I lost 12 pounds. But I'm 188 and I'm five foot four. But anyway, this is how it looks. And I'll see you in the final clip. Okay guys, I talked to the cashier. He let me try it on. He took the sensor off. I have to come immediately back up there immediately after I'm done trying them on. Okay, I'm not gonna show you what they look like on me because that's private. I just wanted to show you that they did take off the sensor. Okay, I'll see you in the next clip. Bye guys. Hey guys, so this is outside the mall. I'm gonna show you the parking lot. There's hardly any stores left. Um, I'm gonna go inside, try to do a chair massage. This is the bench where you wait for the bus. Uh, I think I'm gonna sit down a minute and drink some water I bought from Ross. And I did get the set of two bras. And my blood sugar, I checked it in there because I didn't feel so well, was 309. So I'm gonna drink some water and cool off. This is the Icelandic water. It was like the best for the price. And it was only $2.19. I thought I needed to eat something. I thought my blood sugar was low. And it's just the opposite, it's too high. So it's hot outside. Um, I could go in and drink some. That might be a better idea than sitting out here and drinking it, I think I'll bring it inside. Okay guys, I'll see you in the next clip. Okay guys, I just came inside the mall. There's literally nobody in here. Nail salon that used to be there, close. That's funny, I had a feel funny feeling like there was a ghost in there. Oh my God, did you see something guys? When I play this back, I will like look. I felt something st staring at me. I'm gonna keep walking. The clearance is up ahead. And then they used to have benches where you could sit down. The shoe store even closed. Alta Beauty moved. Um, there's not that much left of the mall. Everything is pretty much shut down. I don't know how clear is this still, still open. Um, even the courtesy desk, as you can see, is nobody there. So the machine looks like it's working. Play area is working. But there's some benches right here. I'm gonna go further down though. There's some massage chairs. And that's normally what I do when I come here is a massage for 15. 20 minutes. First, I'm gonna sit on this wooden bench and take a drink for a while and just relax. Maybe, you know what? I'll go to the massage chair so no one else will steal it and drink while sitting in the massage chair. There's the people coming, I gotta keep the camera low. There's security, so I think I gotta go. Okay, guys, bye. Hey guys, I'm at the mall in the massage chair, about to start my massage. Just wanted to say hi. This is a long video, I know, but bear with me. Um, my neck doesn't feel quite right. So I'm going to pay for my massage and there's also a charging port so I can charge up my phone. Pretty cool, huh? All right, guys, see you in a little bit. Bye. Hey guys, I just left the mall through the Marisa store entrance, or should I say exit. What happened was I was trying to ask if the sign was showing the right price for those purses on the rack. I was gonna show you guys, but there was too many people around and I didn't want to stick out, you know what I mean? I already feel like I've just, you know, ran to enough people here today. Um, 
really nice people for the most part, except that Maurice is associate. That's why I suddenly, there's a reason why I suddenly left and now I'm walking to find the scooter, see if it's still there all the way down here. But I would rather walk to inside to stay cool, but at least I've got my bottle of water. They got the FedEx drop off box over here. And so if you have a FedEx package, you drop off here. Maurice's store associate said when she was coming out, she said hi to me. I says, ma'am, I just have a quick question. She said, I can't help you right at this moment. I have to go to the front. And I thought to myself, it's very rude. The tone of her voice and the way she said it. I'm just paraphrasing how she said it. She just said she couldn't help me. So I threw the purse in the middle of the rack, the one I had in my hand. It was a silver purse. The jean purse is okay, but I still wanted another one and they were only $1.95. Coming up on some people. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Hey everybody, I just got back. That was the scooter I rode to and from the mall. Fortunately, no one snagged it while I was gone. I was about there two hours, maybe. My blood sugar is going down from 309 to 285 when I checked in the bathroom. I'll see you guys in the next clip when I'm back in the room. For my safety, I'm going to head back in. Okay, bye guys. Hey guys, I'm back. As you can see, I'm burned out. My hair is a wreck. I gotta do something with it. I gotta put some leave-in conditioner in it or I'm about to hop in the cool cool shower. If I scream, I scream. I don't care, I'm burning up. Oh my gosh. Like the AC's on in here, but it's gonna take me a while to cool down. I'm gonna get a cool rag. You can come with me. Hope you enjoyed my trip to the mall and everything. I haven't done like a vlog like this. I'm back in the room, so the curtains closed. It's a little dark in here. Hope you can see me okay. Uh, this is what you do when you're like overheated and you, you came off of a scooter ride. Hey, the scooter ride was not a long ride. It took me less than 10 minutes to get back. It was pretty quick. A little bit of traffic, but not too bad. Let me get my face cold water. Get it as cold as I can get it. I cranked that thing up in the bathtub, see? Crank it up. Crank it up. I'm just going over my face. Cool off. I don't need to wash it again. I just need to cool it off. Thank God I didn't wear makeup or it melts it off. I got a compliment from Channel 3 News. I ran into a news reporter at the mall. I didn't show you to her, guys. But I told her I was a YouTube creator and everything and about my resume company. She said she didn't have the authority to film me. I said, too bad you can't do a little advert for me or something. Put the word out. She said she's not in charge of making those decisions. I could respect that, and she was polite. WSL News 3, if you're watching. Hello. I don't remember the lady's name. I follow you guys. Uh, that's our local uh, news channel on TV, Channel 3 News. So that was pretty cool. The only bad thing was the rude Maurice's associate who said she couldn't help me. And all I was asking was a quick question if the price on that shelf, the dollar ninety-five, was for all, everything, like including those purses. Because that was the steal. I would have bought one of those purses. Um, you can always use an extra purse, but I've got a couple extra. I like to collect purses, but I'm going to rest, drink my water, get cooled down, and I got to lower my blood pressure. I mean, um, blood sugar, take my other pill for the day, my Trugenta, and, um, I'm going to turn this light on so I can see what I'm doing. I'm turn this light on so you can see me better. So, let me sit in the chair right real quick and share my final thoughts. So, when I go through the clips, I'll have some thoughts. But, 
I tried on the uh, bras, only one of them. They fit, but I don't know if they're quite like Kathy was talking about, about minimizing their sports bras with the pads. So <laughs> will it help? I don't know. Or I can remove the pads. It said it was like removable pads. If the bras don't work out, I'll be going back to take take it back and get my money back or send my husband Lloyd up up there to return them and get our money back. Um, well, it's more like my money than his money is in my account. But I would give him my cash app card and he could take it up there. I had to run it as credit, guys. I couldn't remember my pin. Oh, I hate that. It's embarrassing. Cashier was nice, though, about it. She's like, it happens. You forget your pin. But love you guys. If you like this video, you've actually, I'm going to make a couple more clips with wearing the new bra and the other shirt just to see how it looks. And so I'll be back in a little bit. Sorry, this is going to be a long video, longer than I thought. But I don't think it'll be complete unless I show you the final thing which is the new bra and the new shirt from Poshmark with it. I got this bra, these two bras. It's a pack of two bras. It was only $10.99 plus tax for two bras. So that's not bad. And then I bought a huge bottle of water to um, lower my blood sugar and stay cool. Um, it's working. It's going down. So I'll be okay. Sorry, the camera was kind of like too low on me. I had to raise my arm up a little bit. But... I will see you guys in the next clip once I have this shirt on with the new bra underneath. See you in a little bit. I'm going to get cooled off first. Okay. See you in a video moment. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. I'm back. I'm starting to cool off. Now, going over how much everything cost me today. The scooter ride... About three dollars is some change each way, so that's the cost of like going one way on Uber. So I saved some money taking the scooter. Um, it's more than taking the bus, but with the bus and in, intense heat like this, I don't like sitting on that hot bench waiting for the bus. It only runs once an hour on a route around the city, so. It's on the Summer East route right now that showed up at the mall. They showed up as I showed up on the scooter, and they were pulling out. So I was thinking, geez, I do have enough change for one way, but I wouldn't have change for, like, two ways. So that's why I was like, I'm only going to save it if my scooter is taken. Then at least I would take the bus and be able to get back from the mall. But um, thankfully, no one took my scooter. Um, most people there had a car and was driving that was parked there so I parked in a handicap area that's just the parallel lines you know like I don't know like the cops never say anything but you can't park like on the sidewalk area that's not a safe zone like because it's too close to the entrance you can't park there you have to park like in the parking lot so I don't want to take up like some vacant space for somebody else. So I just parked in like what looked like the handicap area. Um, and a woman made a comment to me about um, someone throwing a dirty diaper next to her car. I said, because she parked next to a dirty diaper. And she said she would never do that. I said, I never would either, ma'am. I neither, neither would I. Um... And I, and I have two kids. With the two pack of bras was ten ninety nine, and the bottle water was two dollars and nineteen cents. Subtotal thirteen dollars and eighteen cents, with tax after tax being a dollar nine. Total is fourteen twenty seven. That's not bad. And then the chair massage was five dollars and fifty cents. So, I spent basically around twenty bucks. At the mall and then uh, makeup on should I put makeup on guys or my ointment like maybe I should just put my ointment on I'm almost out of this tube 
feel like if I put the ointment on, at least I'm treating the problem instead of just covering it up. You know, getting to the root of the problem by using the ointment, the medicine to treat it. And I know this one's still there. I don't have too many. One lady said I was beautiful, the reporter from Channel 3. So shout out to Channel 3 again for saying that. That was really sweet of her. She was shooting a video for the African American Museum that's about to reopen at a different spot in the mall than where they were at. Um, oops, too much ointment came out of the two. It's okay, I can just use that all over my forehead because I got two on my forehead. So this tube's about spent or used up, however you want to say that. British ways, they say spent. Um... My cats, I don't know what they were up to while I was gone, but I think Baby Kitty wants to go outside. She was by the door. I think that's where she's at right now. Um, this room is a disaster, and <laughs> I need these guys that work here to help me get it cleaned up. Um, so I'd have to add up exactly how much this was to the penny if you wanted to know but you know if uh, if you want me to include the scooter uh around twenty five dollars maybe i spent twenty five twenty six dollars in total between going to the mall the shopping the chair massage was five fifty five dollars fifty cents for fifteen minutes i could only do the minimum shortest time guys and i feel a lot better like my back is cracking as you hear wow it loosened it up really good it loosened it up wow that's pretty good look how much water I drank well Lloyd drank some of this too I ran into him he was working outside he took a big gulp this is a uh, 1500 milliliters 50.7 ounces so liter wise I'm not sure how many liters this is um, but this is Icelandic water too bad it wasn't in a cooler I did tell them at the store at Ross dress for less that I recommend they um, put these in a cooler so people have cold water you know it's hot outside and all that stuff she said she would tell her manager and let her manager know um, that is about it guys except for the very last clip I know this is like going to be a long video my cat's coming um, I'm going to try on the bra in a few minutes and put that other shirt on this is hanging right there in the closet I can see it from here okay guys I'll be back for the final show or final clip I mean okay thanks guys hang in there Give me a moment. Video minute. Okay, guys, this is it. I have to pull the shirt down a little bit. Uh oh, something just tore. The shirt, as I was pulling it down, heard it go a little bit. So, how does this look? Is this better with the new bra? Let me know in the comments. Sure, there's already going to be comments about my mall trip. Let me move over here a little bit more where you can see me. This is. The front of the shirt, and this is the back of the shirt. Let's do a 360. There you go. So, was this worth the time to go to a local store? Probably. Because Amazon was a lot more money. And I still got another one. For I got two for cheaper than I normally get on Amazon, I think. Um, and the bra I was wearing from Amazon I show it to you it's a front closure fruit of the loom bra this is it this is what I've been wearing that's what you saw in my Poshmark unboxing video and this is my other shirt that I was wearing but um, the shirt I can still wear it's not that dirty but this is dirty laundry now so I don't know where I'm gonna put it I'll throw it up there I have Apollo clothes 
up there or I'll just hand wash it in the tub but hey let me sit down gotta sit down so I can have my final thoughts the tag is what's binding this up if I take the tags off then it will come down that line won't be cutting into it so much but I think with the tags still attached I wonder if you guys don't like it if I can return this here's the receipt so you can see how much I paid $10.99 and get my money back I'm gonna wear this for a little while but then I will be stuck with it <clears throat> but I wanted to see how it feels and upload this video and hear your comments yes I still gotta fix my hair and after my ointment dries in about 30 minutes, it's going to give it 30 minutes to do its thing. Then I will put some makeup on, I think. So there'll be maybe, maybe one more clip. Maybe one more clip with my makeup on. And uh, then it'll be a wrap because I, I've done a lot of clips. It's going to be nightmare and editing. Editing, an editing nightmare, but I'll get it figured out. I'll get it figured out. And I hope you have been enjoying my vlog, my mall vlog. I'm going to call it today's log vlog and date it. Today is Juneteenth, June 19th. Happy Juneteenth. And today's also my anniversary with my hubby. Um, this is the day we celebrate our anniversary because it's the day we met at the store and at Aldi's in Marion, Illinois gro grocery store. So we kind of, I think hit it off right, right then and there in the store. So I feel like I started dating him that day because we talked and then I went to his place and hung out and, uh, the rest is history. I wouldn't be on YouTube even if it wasn't for him because I didn't have a smartphone years ago I only had a flip phone I didn't believe in smartphones see this is still puckering up a little bit it's just this shirt was shrunk Kathy I think someone shrunk the shirt you know when they washed it so it'll be okay either bra or wear I think it'll be okay but yeah I, I needed some better bras these are padded maybe if I would remove the pads see this is padded hate to get kind of personal it's supposed to be removable pads let me look at it see if that's the case how do you remove the pad I don't see oh I feel it now on the side guys I don't know if you can see right there you can remove the pad there's an opening on the side on each side of the bra sure you, I can remove it if I need to so let me know should I keep it with the pads or remove it because I'm not an expert in this stuff and I've had problems finding my size for years this was a 3x and they were hesitant to let me try them on try it on in the store the one I'm wearing they were hesitant to let me try it on but I took the sensor off I said just come straight back up here when you're done so I did what the man said and then a different employee helped check me out and asked if everything was okay I said no I'm frustrated because it's hot in here I had to wait just to try on the bras had to wait a little while I was standing there overheated my blood sugar is high I checked in the fitting room and I'm not feeling too good she didn't offer like medical assistance or calling 911 or anything like that didn't offer anything like that but actually Guys, I'm going to take a nap. I think I'm going to lay down for a little while. I got this headache. I've been taking Excedrin. And I need to eat lunch. It's like about 2 p.m. Receipt shows I was at the Ross store at 12.23. So I didn't spend much time at the mall. Um, I got back here about 1.40. 1.30-ish. There was no mail for me today, so that's okay. Um, 
I got a pen pal letter, Kim. Hi, Kim from Canada. I got a pen pal letter the other day from a lady in Oklahoma. She was asking and I'm answering her question real quick. And I am in the process of writing back to her first because she's domestic and I am limited on my stamps. I will hopefully have enough left to write to you. But she's in a crisis, so I need to write to her first and give her some comfort and encouragement and all that and um, when she writes the letters it makes her feel better and so I need to keep writing to her more regularly and cheer her up but I'll write to you as well but I'm just saying it costs more for me and I'm on a fixed income from the government called Social Security Disability so just bear with me on that and love you guys. Take care of yourselves and each other because we all need someone. We've come, finally come to the end of this mall vlog video. I'm back at home. And this is how it looks with the new bra. I mean, this is about as good as it's going to get with any local store. With my size. Even Walmart, if I went to Walmart. You know, it's just... The shirt itself is maybe a little too small, but I'll make it work. Um, I could, like, put a cardigan or something over it. But this is pretty heavy. This is pretty heavy. If I wear this outside, will I be hot? I only want to wear this, like, when I'm indoors. Because this is a thick material, whatever this material is in the shirt. That's why I wore my other shirt, this one. The paisley one that you saw that's similar most of the day because this kept me cooler when I was hot and this has got um, this is a 1x this is a 0x that's the difference and the material of the shirt I was wearing I will tell you hold on let me see there's a tag there's a tag 96% polyester, 4% spandex made in China. So, mostly polyester, guys. And Baby Kitty is here to say hi. She's looking around. What, Baby Kitty? We checking everything out? We checking everything out? It's okay. It's okay. You can check it out. Don't sit on it. You should see her, guys. It's too cute. I'll show you her. She just wanted to be part of it again, of another video, and be the star of the final clip. So you guys take care of yourselves and each other, because we all need someone, and take care of your fur babies. Keep them indoors when it's hot like this. Not good for them to be outside Unless they're outdoor cats, then I understand that they're used to it. But at least leave plenty of water outside and food for them. Oh my gosh, outdoor cats got it rough right now. So I, I, and the dogs too. If you got a dog or cat or whatever, or whatever animal you got, or, or bunny rabbit. Some people got fer ferrets and bunny rabbits. Well, whatever animal you got, take care of your animals. I love animals, and even if you feed, just feed the birds in the park, or the geese, or whatever, God bless you for doing that too, love you guys, you mean the world to me, take care of yourselves, and you, 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 take care of you, I can't lost my outro there, take care of yourselves and each other, because we all need someone, thanks for watching, appreciate you taking the time to, and spending the day with me at the mall. And at, here at home for a little few minutes. And I will see you in my next video. Again, thanks for watching. Give a like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. And have a wonderful day. Bye for now.